Welcome back to Living 808. When disaster strikes, Belfort, Hawaii will be there to help. Jeremy Schmalfeld, general manager, and Vern Peters, project manager, join us. Guys, not trying to be a downer here, but <laughs> stuff happens, and you guys can help. Tell us, uh, who is Belfort, Hawaii? Well, Belfour is uh, the largest disaster recovery and property restoration company in the world. And uh, we service uh, both homeowners and businesses to help restore their properties uh, when disaster strikes. Mm -hmm. uh, what our CEO has coined is we do the best of things in the worst of times. We really do get to you know, help out in some really difficult situations, uh, especially inclement weather. When it comes in, um, no matter how mild or no, how, no matter how severe, uh, we're able to respond 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Uh, to get things back up in order. Um, even last year uh, with the Tropical Storm Darby, when it yeah. came through, Kalihi Stream kind of overflowed, affecting a lot of the companies and, and the businesses in that area. We were able to come out, extract, do some uh, uh, water mitigation, and, and put people back in business. Um, 2015 uh, had a couple of hurricane storms, Ignacio and Jimena. Yeah. They came through, really did some detrimental uh, work to downtown. So we were integral in, in uh, assisting with those. Even uh, 2011, the tsunami um, from the Japan earthquake, mm -hmm. able to help out there. And probably the most well-known is 2004, Manoa Falls flood uh, that took place and affected the Hamilton Library. Um, our company was able to come in and uh, really help uh, the document restoration aspect of that project. Yeah, Vern, Vern tell us a little bit about how you, how you guys help hurricane or flooding victims. What, what do you guys do? Sure. So Belfort Property Restoration uh, can come in. You're either your commercial or your residential area. Do the mitigation and get you back to pre-loss condition as quickly as possible. Not only can Belfort do the uh, mitigation portion of it, we mm -hmm. also have skilled uh, contractors come back and put your uh, residential and your commercial uh, business up and running as quickly as possible. Yeah, what, what happens with a commercial business? How, how does that work? So a lot of times commercial businesses either have flooding. We come in, make sure everything is safe and clean so that you can get back up and running. You might want to take a day off here at the company, but uh, we'll try to get you back to pre-loss condition as much as quick, quickly as possible. I guess if, uh, if it's a business, you're thinking maybe documents, important papers, how can you help with that? And that's, that's a big aspect that you know often gets overlooked. Is is what do you do when you know valuable documents get wet? Mm -hmm. You know uh, what what things can you do from a preventative nature uh, um, standpoint? And and uh, I think the biggest thing that we have to focus on is stopping the degradation or or the damage to, of increasing documents. So what we do is um, we freeze them, and it kind of stops the clock on uh, the saturation uh, for the documents. And then once, once they're frozen, we're able to ship them to our Fort Worth, Texas office, where we have a sublimation chamber, which we're able to dry them out without going through uh, the liquid phase again. So it goes from a frozen to a gas. And uh, then there's also processes after that that uh, can help uh, heat press to get them out of their you know, wrinkly phase. We have a decontamination <laughs> up to and including uh, gamma radiation. So we have certified um, you know, uh, checks for you know, it's free from contaminants. Um, and then, you know, really bring them back to where people thought they were lost. I mean, we've been able to do that uh, with the Manoa Falls flood with uh, old maps of Oahu, which are historic. I mean, things that, you know, we would not be able just to replace, um, we, we, we were able to restore. Uh, we've also been able to do that with, you know, wedding albums and, and baby pictures. I mean, things that are wow. irreplaceable and uh, need to be taken into consideration. That's really, really cool. I mean, so you guys come in, you help when things have already happened, do you have tips to maybe prevent some things from, ha from happening? Sure. First thing, if you're in a flood situation or severe world situ situation, get out, get safe. There's a lot of things that are associated with flooding uh, that are dangerous. Mm -hmm. Drowning, uh, poor water conditions, mm -hmm. uh, to name a few, electrical shock, Ooh, and also yeah. um, and, and some dirty water and some diseases as well. So once you're safe, contact your insurance company. Uh, they will direct you to a reputable uh, mitigation company and by that process we can get you back to pre loss condition. Thank you guys so much. How can somebody get a hold of you guys real quick? Uh, www.bell4hawaii.com and uh, our, our phone number is 486-9388. And you can check it on our website. Yes you can. Thank you guys for being here. I appreciate awesome. it so Thank much. You, Thank you appreciate so much. Thank All you. right we're gonna throw it on over to Mikey and Trini at the monitor. That's right. Thank you.